While the National Development Plan 2 is yet to be put in place, experts say that integrating local content and space within the nascent oil sector and aligning it to the Vision 2040 must be pursued. Of bringing everyone on board, all the stakeholders in managing oil and gas resources and ensuring that oil resources do not only benefit the present generation but also the future generation. These concerns have emerged at a discourse on accelerating growth and maintaining intergenerational equity using oil resources in Uganda, convened by the Economic Policy Research Center here in Kampala. We all have to be adequately prepared in order to tap into this new opportunity before us. Otherwise, it will be, a, as the saying goes, a fortune in the hands of an unprepared person is a great misfortune. And then we start working a roadmap against that picture. And this is where we want to be. A Uganda, after 30 years of oil, with a technical school in every sub county, with the local industries, not importing cotton clothes, you know, with local companies. You and in spite the new legislation in place, but actually covering the oil sector, experts are also pressing for counter audit measures ahead of full commercial production. If you read it, you will agree with me that it's a very good policy. The issue is, again, governance. And the issue is how is it going to be implemented as it has actually been written out. Raina Ojan, NTV Business.